When I've seen the photograph in the journal, I recognize it instantly because we've had this photograph for so long. I was really surprised. I didn't realize it was so important to the police department. I just assumed that everybody had photographs of policemen in buffalo coats, so I didn't think it was the only one. <laughs> he was always fascinated by those buffalo coats. He, he thought they were neat, really neat. And he was just learning, like the trade, like he had absolutely no clue about photography. He was actually originally from Germany, he was a bricklayer, and then he came to Canada in 1954 and he became a plaster because there was really no bricks to be laid in Edmonton. And he became a plaster and he got, he didn't want to do this anymore. And some friends of ours had a studio and he would help them out and he thought, oh, I could do this, this is really neat. <laughs> so I'm really surprised that this photograph actually ended up so famous. We never thought about it actually. You would think that the police officers themselves would have photographed each other in those big coats, but I guess, yeah. I don't know. Yeah. It's too bad Peter isn't here because he yeah. would be just, oh, he, would. <laughs> he, would, he, took, yeah, he would really love that. Yeah.